Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Levin R. Marshall was an American banker and southern planter who owned large tracts of land in Mississippi, Louisiana, and Arkansas. He was also the founder and president of the Commercial Bank of Natchez. Born in Alexandria, Virginia, Marshall started his career as a banker for the United States Bank in Woodville, Mississippi, before moving to Natchez in 1831. In addition to establishing his own bank, Marshall owned the Mansion Hotel in Natchez and worked for commission houses based in New Orleans. According to one account, Marshall became a leader in national financial circles. While in Natchez, Marshall and his family resided at his elegant suburban villa, Richmond. In order to avoid the suffocating heat of the southern summers, however, Marshall and his family moved to Hawkswood, a celebrated estate in Westchester County, New York, overlooking Long Island Sound. By 1860, Marshall owned 817 African slaves. But like a number of other Natchez planters, he was a decided Unionist. Marshall left Natchez after the Civil War with his family and spent the remainder of his life at his New York home. Marshall died on this day, July the 24th, in 1870. Today, Marshall's descendants own and maintain Richmond, the Natchez family home, which has been described as one of the country's most important documents of mid-19th century life. In the early 20th century, the city of New York purchased Hawks Wood as the nucleus for Pelham Park, and for a while, the great Greek Revival mansion served as the colonial inn. Sadly, the house was torn down in 1936. I'm Leila Jean Nall, and I am a descendant of Levin Marshall. I'm the lucky person that gets to live in this house, and this is your Natchez History Minute.